every time I start trying to film, somebody makes a noise. Like, oh my god. Okay. And I'm trying to sit still in this chair, but like, for some reason, my floor isn't even or something. Like, I have no idea, but it's like extra annoying and my chair just keeps moving by itself, as you can see. Anyways, hi. I don't know where to start. I know it's not summer yet, but like, it's actually really hot here right now, so I'm kind of like forced into wearing my summer clothes, sort of. I put together some outfits that you could get inspired off of, I guess. I don't know. Sorry, I'm moving so much. This chair literally looks like so bad. A lot of the outfits use the same kinds. This use the, um, a lot of the outfits use the same clothing items, but I just kind of like made them a little bit different and like added different things. You'll see. So the first outfit, I am wearing these shorts. They were kind of expensive, like, not gonna lie, um, they're probably um, $30, maybe more. It's really hard for me to find shorts that fit me properly because of my body shape. I'm not saying I'm like big or anything, but because like my hips are really big and like my waist is not very big, so it was like really exciting for me that these ones even fit me um they don't fit me like pro like they don't fit me exactly right but they do fit me pretty well they're really comfy as you can see i like have worn them a lot and they're also distressed and they're light wash which is like beautiful you've probably seen them like a million times in my like instagram pictures if you follow me the first outfit does feature these and other outfits do too. Couldn't find you anywhere when you broke down and didn't leave you. Yeah. Um, this outfit does include this tank top. Um, it's also from Garage. I bought it also like a month ago. All this stuff is pretty, it's either really old or really new. This blue I've been like obsessing over lately. I've only got this thing in blue. Um, but I'm gonna get more things soon, especially because summer is coming and I'm trying to get more colorful things other than having like blacks and grays, which like everyone seems to want to wear lately. It was actually on sale at Garage, which is also one of my favorite stores if you didn't already know that, if you've ever heard of it. I don't know, a lot of like Americans probably don't know what Garage is, but I mean, I probably don't know a lot of stories that are in the U.S. The cover-up kimono piece that I'm wearing is this one right here. It's from Winners. Um, I got it about a month ago, maybe two months ago now. Um, so it's kind of new. I bought it for Cuba when I went on vacation recently as like a cover-up for like the beach. But honestly, like, I found out that it actually works with a lot of different outfits. So yeah, it's really light and it's very flowy. So it's probably, like, perfect for summer if you want to be covered up but you don't want to be hot, like, with a huge cardigan on or a sweater or anything like that. So this one is really perfect for days like those. This chair is so nice. Okay. I would say it would go with more simpler outfits. But you can do whatever you want. So yeah, that's this. Okay, so let's move on to the next outfit. The next outfit that you just saw does feature this shirt. Um, it is from Forever 21. And it's just a burgundy high neck crop top. It's not very crop, like probably goes a little bit above my belly button, but I've really been in love with 
um, burgundy recently since like the fall. I bought a lot of burgundy things. I just bought this shirt probably a month ago I want to say. So it was recent. Yeah, I'm trying to buy more like plain um, clothing so I can make more outfits together instead of buying things with patterns because it's more difficult for me to make outfits with patterns. Um, so I'm trying to get more of like plain things. So that outfit also featured this flannel. I don't know why I keep saying features like it's some kind of like superstar or something. It's also from Forever 21. I got a medium and I got it so it could be baggy. I didn't want it like tight but it did shrink in the wash and I was very upset. So I don't really wear it as like a sweater. I more just wear it if it's like around my waist just as like an accent or whatever. I love the colors on the plaid and I love the pattern of the plaid. I don't really like plaid that's very like small boxy. I don't know how to explain it, but like this kind of plaid is like it's, um, wider kind of squares and it's less color. I don't know really know how to explain it, but if you know what I mean, <laughs> you know what I mean. I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, that kind of plaid's really good and I really love it. Okay, moving on. These shorts are high waisted and they actually fit me. So yeah, I got these shorts. They're from Boohoo. If you haven't heard of Boohoo, they are one of the clothing sites that I have found over the past year. Their prices are pretty reasonable. Um, they aren't very expensive at all, especially for the quality of their clothes. I bought a few things from there and I actually have liked everything I bought so far. There's nothing really I can say negative about them. They do have free shipping if you spend over a certain amount. That's like really amazing since I do live in Canada like I probably said a million times throughout this video. A lot of the stores that I actually go online and try and buy from don't ship to Canada or they ship to Canada and it's literally like $30 for normal shipping which is ridiculous so usually I don't buy things from those kinds of websites unless I'm in love with things that like I need and there's no other way I can get it other than to pay the shipping yeah with Boohoo it actually affordable clothing they're good quality and free shipping if you spend over a certain amount and I'm pretty sure it's for like every country I don't think it's just for Canada I think it's different amounts but I think you still get free shipping if you're in different countries. So yeah, these shorts are very comfy and they're white and they have lace. And if you didn't know, I like love lace. So just a plus. This outfit features this top, this tank top from Forever 21. Um, it's one of the favorite things that I did buy from Forever 21 recently. I bought it online and I wasn't really sure if it was gonna like fit me properly or like be as cute as it looked like online but it actually is really cute and I'm really happy I bought it in great also. Probably gonna buy it in different colors now that I have two and I really want to wear it with like every outfit and it's a crop top. Compared to the burgundy one it is a little bit shorter. It probably goes here I want to say on me but I am short so I've got a small you might maybe want to go a medium I would wear it more with like a high-waisted shorts or high-waisted skirt it could be worn so many different ways that's why I like it this is gonna be great to edit Um, for that outfit is this one right here. It is a one size fits all so like it, it was kind of like a hit or miss. I don't really like buying clothes that are one size fits all just because everyone's a different shape and I feel like it's really misleading sometimes when you see it on a mannequin and you're like oh it's really cute and then you go and put it on and it doesn't look anything like what you just saw. Um, Brandy Melville is like number one for that stuff. I know like a lot of people don't like how they have one sizes. Because I'm smaller it's easier for me to find things there but some of the things they look really good like on the mannequin or I see them like on other people and I'm like oh that's so cute and then I put it on. <laughs> okay. 
I put it on and it's like totally different than what I thought it would look like. I have a few things like that to be honest in my closet probably need to get rid of. Anyways, back to this kimono. Um, this was one of the first kimonos that I bought. I bought it last year when the kimono trend, I guess, was starting. really like it. I like how the pattern is, it's not too much, like you could wear it with different things and it has a bunch of colors in it so you can always wear more than just like black or white or gray shirt underneath it. I like how that has those little details, I think it's like really cute. And it's really light, like well, like I said before with the other one, you could always just wear it on top of something if you wanted to just have something over top of you and you didn't want to show too much and still wouldn't be too hot. Like it's really, really light fa fabric. You could see like right through it. So yeah, this is one of the first kimonos that I've bought and I have bought other ones after this one, but this was my first one that I ever bought and I'm, and I'm never probably going to throw it out. I swear I'm not doing this. Like my legs are not on the ground and I'm not touching anything. It really doesn't want me to film or something. Like I have no idea. So thanks for watching my video. I hope I inspired you just a little bit with these outfits. If you like this video, obviously like it. Um, if you want to see more of me, subscribe to my channel. And if you have any ideas for a next video, for something that you would like to see, just comment below. Um, everything that I'm wearing in this video will be in the description. So like I said, thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time.